maybe just quickly start with what's what's your role with the company? Yeah, so um, the product line director for L and H, I, I look after all overall all of our product lines, but uh, specifically, I focus on the mining shovels. Um, I've I've grew up working for Bosiris uh, as a field service engineer, and then oh, okay. came on board with L and H. Uh, 12 years ago now, and I've been chasing around these machines, specifically rope shovels, um, in the Canadian market, U.S. market, and all of South America for quite some time now. I was snooping around on the L&H through, like, through the team, and I, I everybody's like 11, 12, or more years, yeah. so there's something to be said about that. Um, and hey, Kayla, what's your role? First time on the show, you manage the project of actually putting uh, this lathe in, so... Uh, yeah. What, what's your what's your day to day role when you're not putting one of these in the ground? <laughs> oh yeah, sure. Uh, so I manage our engineering department here in Tempe. Um, I also oversee our coordination team here in Tempe as well. Um, been with the company 17 years. Wow. Uh, five years are corporate, and then 12 years here. So yeah, part of the average group, I yeah. guess. But yeah. Um, I want we we have a lot to get into today. Um, and we I want to get into the I want to get into the shovels pretty quick because I want people to understand the capabilities of what this machine does. So Kayla, I want to sort of kick things off too is just helping people understand where we're we're sitting and what we're sitting in. Um, we're going to get into the shovels so people can understand the capacity that this machine has, but maybe just outline what this is. Sure. Yeah. So we are sitting on the 27 foot diameter table, part of this VTL. So um, it can actually handle um, 250 tons on the table. So we're, it doesn't even recognize that we're on it, I'm sure. <laughs> um, so uh, we brought it in, you know, to, you know, just really increase our capabilities here in Tempe in multiple markets as well. So yeah, uh, how we're going to, we're going to do a full, at the end of it, we'll uh, talk a little bit more about the project itself. Um, what kind of timeline does it take to install this? Because this is, I forget, this is like, it's like 25 feet deep under the ground or something with the concrete. and Yeah, we had to go about 25 feet deep, um, about 7,000 cubic yards of concrete wow. you know, to isolate this uh, foundation. So it took two years, uh, basically May of 2022, and we started making chips June uh, 24. So. Wow. 